Welcome, everyone. I see you've already met some of the many beasts we study in this class. Though be advised, none of these creatures should be taken lightly. They are all in their own way dangerous, especially if one does not know how to handle them properly. Now, it seems many of you are out of practice. Let's take some time to review the basics of how to care for a beast, shall we? Miss Sweeting, would you please assist our new student with the lesson today? Yes, Professor Howen. Hello, I'm Poppy, Poppy Sweeting. Don't worry about Professor Howen's speech. She over-exaggerates sometimes. <laughs> All the beasts in class are perfectly safe. Oh! Miss Sweeting, pay attention, please. The tongue of a puffskin can be a slippery devil. Uh, yes, Professor. Here, you can practice on Gerald. Just keep an eye out for his tongue. <laughs> you can use my brush. Just be gentle. Oh, and think pleasant thoughts. I like to think it enriches his experience. That's lovely. I'm sure he feels much better. I think he might be hungry. Would you mind giving him some beast feed? What do you suppose the pellets taste like to Gerald? Pudding, I like to think. <laughs> I think we can safely say that Gerald likes you. That's good news. He seems very nice. He is. Kindness is one of his best qualities, right after ambition and cleanliness. Good work, everyone. Now, let's make our way to the pens and select another beast. And please, do be careful as you feed and groom them. Miss Sweeting, why don't you show our new student to the measles in the farthest pen? This way, the measles are over here. Oh, a couple of measles whiskers ought to get me a few canuts at least. Enough to buy something from Honey Jukes. <laughs> uh, stupid thing. Oh. Uh. What in Merlin's uh. name are you doing? Uh, tuss, tuss, peculiar Poppy. Worried about a worthless little rodent? Her name is Persephone! <laughs> Her name is Persephone! <laughs> That's really not funny. <sighs> Let's go. Those two don't belong anywhere near this class. Coaches in training. Persephone was on to them instantly. Thank you for your help. Let's carry on. Feed and brush the measles just as you did with Gerald.
The Neasles really took to you. They know a good egg when they see one. As do I. It appears our time has come to an end. Please close the pens and see yourselves out. Now, where is our new student? Ah, there you are. I would like a moment, please. Hello, Professor. You wanted to speak with me? I did. How did you find your first beast's lesson? It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Good. Some provide us with magically imbued... which does not include torturing them for whiskers. Yes, Professor. They're nearly as bad as the savages in stumbling over dead beasts. Terrible weight. Surely the poachers can be brought to justice. Hmm. An optimistic idea. Now, Professor Weasley has asked, be on the lookout for my... Meanwhile, I... Hey, over here. Come on. Do you need something, Poppy? Thank you again for saying something to... You were an augury at noon in the desert. I certainly hope that's a good thing. It's something my gran and I say. At least, that's what we decided it meant. I couldn't... We're of a similar mind. I'm not sure. What's this all about? You'll see. I wouldn't take just anyone there. In fact, you're the first. Really? Well, thank you, I think. As I said, we think alike. Pleasant surprise. <sighs> Quite the weather we're having, don't you think? Poppy, where are you taking me? It really is much better if I just show you. Don't worry, we're nearly there. It's just ahead. Stand back. <laughs> Please meet High Wing. Isn't she just magnificent? <laughs> Go on, introduce yourself to her. But be careful. You must always show hippogriffs the proper courtesy before you approach them. someone this quickly. You can feed a brush her if you'd like. I come and check on her every once in a while. Bring her pasties, tell her what's going on in the castle. You wouldn't know from looking at her, but she's a dreadful busybody. So, what did you think of High Wing? I thought she was brilliant. Can't believe... I suspected you two might get a... Are you the reason students have been seeing hippogriffs flying above the Forbidden Forest? Mm, perhaps. Did you know that once you... I've seen it firsthand with her. How exactly did you and High Wing cross paths? You may have noticed that poachers are something of a problem. Professor Howen mentioned the poachers as well. I don't often agree with Professor... The poacher's influence is... they're up to something. That does seem strange. Exactly. 
I think I'm going to look it. I think that's a fine idea. And the more I know, the better I can... You seem undeterred. Will you let me know what you find? Oh, very well. I should be going, but we'll speak again... Let me in, sir. 